Yeah! yeah. Club. All right, welcome back, guys, to Final Fantasy II. Uh, we're back in the ice cave. Yeah, we are. Yeah. This is it's the best ice cave. Still late at night. It is still, still late at night. Still dragging on the ice cave. Wow. Uh, he's getting better. Like, his, I'm not sure if you paid attention or not, but like, his stats have been going up. Like his endurance, HP, and strength, and all that. Huh? Like, he's getting better and better. Cool. So Yosef's not like Yosef wasn't useless to begin with. But. No, but I mean he's even less useless. What? It's like he's not really useless at all. He's very useful and practical. Like I'm glad we have Joseph in the party. Uh, Yosef. Yosef Yosefison. Yeah. I forget what. It was. Um. Like it's been 20 minutes since we said it, and I I don't know what it was. Absolutely. Um. Which reminds me, like. The name just sounds Russian, but like, uh, did I ever tell you my theory about like how I'm not sure Russia's a real place? No, you haven't. <laughs> um, that's dumb. It, 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 co it started as like a complete joke theory. Uh huh. Oh, cool. Don't need that. More stuff to sell. Mm -hmm. This is sell fodder. And like, honestly, I, I don't believe it's true, but it's just a funny story to tell people. Yeah. Um. Ugh. Oh, Good God. story, Sam. Uh, <laughs> oh, it hurt. Like, that sounded oh, really God. loud to me. There was, like, a little bit of hard roll in it, too, that, like, bounced around in my throat while I burped. Oh, that sounds oh, disgusting. It hurt. That's what happened. <laughs> anyway. Um, <laughs> uh, back, back to Russia. Uh, uh, not Russia, because Russia doesn't exist. <laughs> R Russia's a lie made up by the government. But just, like, everything I've seen of Russia is always super crazy and eccentric. Uh -huh. Like, they have Vladimir Putin as their president, you know, the guy who rides horses bareback in the mountain range. I want it to be noted, um, that is so round and true that this is the third time in our, like, what, eight, nine episodes that we've brought up Russia. Yeah. Russia's fucking weird. like you like I said back to the Russian order mail bribes you can just buy people uh no don't they, say it in those words because Tim will quote it and put it as the title oh God that was so dumb also that, that's that, not even what was said go back and watch that video see what we actually say it's much nicer than that mm -hmm. we're gonna put a link in the description people are but, gonna watch it but, <laughs> I, they have to but like I, I don't want to get <laughs> off track because like I, I'm I'm trying to focus because I'm real tired. I'm trying to focus on Final Fantasy. And like, Russia. And, like, why Russia isn't a real place. It's not a real place, okay. But, like, there's the whole, like, uh, the Slavic culture. What's Slavic? It's, like, the Adidas and, like, uh, crouch, like, the crouching down and putting your hands, like, the Team Skull thing. Okay. Where they're crouching and all that. And, like, they all wear sweatsuits and listen to, like, Songs that sound eerily simu similar, like similar, the, simu like hard, the hard bass thing. Okay. Like the Russian hard bass, and like, and just like the videos I've seen don't feel like they all feel like they were taken in the same like neighborhood kind of. Um, that's because the we live in a um, capitalistic society. Yeah. In terms of economics, I don't remember what it's called, but Russia society is everything is made the same. You pick a producer, that producer makes all of the products. Which, so, like, if you want pencils, one person is making pencils. If you want cars, one person is making cars. There's no competition out there to provide an encouragement to improve your product in any way, shape, or form. This is functional, this works, this car was made in the, the 70s, and it gets you where you need to go. This is the car that we are all going to drive. All right. So like, yeah, it's super eerily the same because it kind of has to be. You just don't have the option for it to not be eerily the same. All right, but like, Russia should, What's what? happening? Beavers, talk to one. <laughs> I was kind of expecting that to be a fight. 
Grrrrg! What does this have to do with anything? In the Grrrrg! Is this the Beaver King? Grrrrg, grrrrg! Dude, tell me! I understand <laughs> animal work! <laughs> Gus is so dumb, he's on him. par. I love him! I speak with him. <laughs> I was like, yeah, whatever, Gus, do your thing. Grar grar. <laughs> Alright, alright, Gus. Opening in right wall. Monster protecting bell. Bell inside wall. Uh-huh. Uh, I should... You're not... So we, we know where it is. Wild Rose. Alright. Cool. Thanks, Gus. Where's the right wall? Well, this is the right wall. But it said monster protecting wall. So, like... I don't know. I feel... I, I'm gonna figure that talk, out again. Talk to him again, yeah. So... Is it the same same line? Okay. Yeah. So uh -huh. I guess it's saying the same stuff, so like got a spell. Okay. He's all like grog 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 grog. And Gus is like, understand. <laughs> Opening in right wall. Monster, Monster protecting bell. bell. Bell inside wall. So Is that over <sighs> What? This little patch right here? Yeah, it looks different, but it's like, not. That's what I thought too. Okay, um So might be actually outside of here. Maybe? Because, like, there's still more to explore down here. Is there? Yeah, there's this, all this right here. Also, we didn't explore the whole whole right side of that wall. Yeah, we did. Nah. Like, I didn't I didn't check the wall for, like, you know, openings to the goddess bell, but Jesus Christ, Joseph. Yeah, Joseph, uh, he's a powerhouse. He walks into the party like, yeah, I'm pretty strong. And then slowly but surely revealed his true power level. <laughs> Uh, it was uh, over nine but thousand. yeah, just back to more Russia to finish up that, uh, <laughs> what, a, what, ancient sword? And a monster appeared. Alright. What's ancient sword? I don't know. We're yeah. gonna have to give that to Burian. There's no debate on this. Definitely. But, but no. like, just... Guess is blind. A lot of things I've seen about Russia have seen, have seemed so surreal and like, like it shouldn't be there. Okay. Know. Maybe I've spent too much time on the internet and just starting to think, like, maybe Russia isn't a real place. I'm like, they just... I don't know. I should probably get off the topic before I start, you know, sitting here, like, thinking about... Oh, dude, just really like Cassie and Angel cursed. That's awesome. That... Is Spirian gonna be cursed? No, don't, don't, don't. I don't think he'll be cursed, but I think he, like, attacks with curses. See, that'd be the ideal situation. Yeah. I have my doubts. There was a uh, one game I played. I forget what it was, but like one of the mechanics in it was that um, like whenever you equip something, it had the chance of being a cursed item. Like it had a bunch of really good stats and things like that, uh -huh. but it would, it would curse you, and you wouldn't be able to take the item off without doing something like special for it. Okay. And like uh. It always had, I think it had some sort of negative all the time, but not all the time. I'm not sure. I can't remember. I don't even, I'm not even sure if it was like a game mechanic or anything, but. <laughs> Good point. Maybe the game's it. not real like Russia. The game is Russia. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, that's his act skill. Good. We'll be doing more damage now. We need to find a hole in a wall to the right. Yep. So I'm gonna look back down here on the giant beaver. Yeah. It's kinda. Maybe we could look it up or something. Yeah, that'd be crazy. Yeah. It's not like, you know. Remember what Tim said. What, no walkthroughs? Yeah. Well, and how they're using a walkthrough in Final Fantasy 1. Remember what Seth said. Yeah. All you, walkthroughs. We'll look it all up. Alright, let's let's find out what's going on. Final Fantasy. To walk through. I feel like it's in this room, though. Uh, you're probably right. Hey, Giant Beaver. Thanks, Giant Beaver. Is that it? Nope. 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 
Wasted all of Maria's MP. Nah, no, don't even worry about it. That like, was a great, great call. <laughs> That's not helpful at all. What's up? What's it saying? Nothing. It shows a picture of every floor, but not like doors and stuff. Uh, I mean, it shows where doors are. It just doesn't show where where anything actually is. All right. So, so uh, like this, we've already seen this. Yeah. So useless. Go back to playing the game, Sam. Oh, sorry. I'm walkthroughs. You're you're not walkthroughs. You're right. I'm not walkthroughs. You're Sam. I'm walkthroughs. Welcome back to the Yak Club. <laughs> I'm, back, <laughs> I'm back here today with uh, walkthroughs with Walker Walkerson. <laughs> That's uh, uh, what they call me. How are you doing, Walkie? I'm uh, I'm walking along through and through. You know. Yeah. That was bad. I'm sorry. So I'm out of guesses at where it could be. Same here. Oh, show extended details is a button. Not not useful at all. Maybe there's like a YouTube video you could look up? Like a YouTube video? <laughs> no. No? No. Is that even the same game? Yep. Oh, yeah, okay. Just different graphics looking. Because we're playing the remastered. Fucking Billy got on my ass because I apparently said this is the PS3 version. He did. We actually had a discussion about it and well, he didn't get on your ass. He said people were going to comment eventually and say shit like that and you're gonna have to be able to deal with it because you said something stupid I'm gonna cry oh no I have a potion left oh no okay it says push against the right wall until you're able to walk through and reach the final floor so apparently you just have to be consistent fuck it where though uh, my guess is on that one square. In the, in the beaver place? Yep, just keep walking. So... Like, that's a super dumb mechanic. Push right. Right here. Keep, that's that's what it seemed to imply. Nothing's going on. Nothing. Uh... I... <sighs> what, <you can't... gasps> wow. Had you tried that square before? I'm sure I have. I don't believe you. <laughs> All right. Cool. <laughs> so <laughs> there's a lot of secret walls in this game. Yeah. Like, like there's only so much that they can do to provide puzzles. Secret yeah. walls is kind of the best they got going on. I feel like you're in this is a lot using the ancient sword. Maybe. Like, uh, I mean, I'll look at his accuracy after this. I should stop fucking with Mike again. Yeah. Sam. Alright, on the break, I'm gonna bring a foot rest in here. <laughs> <laughs> wow, Yosef needs the potion. Yeah. Um, they need a lot of stuff. Ooh, I thought we over over grinded, but clearly we under grinded. No, we didn't under grind, it's just that like, you know, you can only take, you know, uh, Two damage so many times. Nah. You take two damage a thousand times. <laughs> so, two thousand damage. This is gonna potion Joseph. And hope we'll be okay. Alright. Did that not look like a downward staircase? Did we. Okay. Or, no, I see what we're gonna fight. Look at that thing. Oh. Too bad we don't have. That looks like it's resistant to physical attacks. And would be super and weak to ice magic. Yeah. Based on the other tortoises. Don't oh, worry, oh. we got preemptive strike. Yeah. I feel like Mithril did better. Like, I know his attack went up. Yeah. But the numbers are just lower. Well, I mean, not the damage. No, yeah, the damage is lower. He was doing like 100. Now, like, the high, high roll is 84. It's fine. Uh, I get well, like, uh, it. 
it inflicts status ailments, so like I at least want to try and use it against the boss. Yeah. And, like the cool thing about this game is we can switch between weapons. That's nice. So, like in the middle of battle. I think it takes up their turn now. Oh, well, don't do that. But like I mean like if we inflict that boss with the status ailment and then like switch to the nuclear sword and start hitting for more accuracy. Um, like, their HP's gonna be so good. Yeah. Which will be awesome. That's fair. Ow. Gus took Kill. nine whole damage? Yeah. Yosef does so many pains. It's he's, great. He's a DPS monk, for mm -hmm. sure. He has, he, he has nothing but the... Oh! <gasps> Every single character's holding a potion. Uh-huh. I forgot about that. Silver plate? It's like, you're gonna get screwed so hard, here's better equipment. Is that better than Mithril? Uh, maybe? It's the same. Uh, maybe on someone else? No? No? Okay, well... I'm not gonna give well, it to you. Yeah, cause he doesn't need it. you'll leave our party here soon. It's the Guardian of the Goddess spell, the Adamantus. Is he an adamantine uh, tortoise? I assume so. Tortoise? Oh, man. A everyone knows adamantine's better than mithril, so uh, yeah. we're gonna lose. All we have is four people so, wearing mithril. Let's see, there's a bunch of potion around. Ow. Alright, cool. So the adamantoise now has something negative. Yeah. How did we just heal him? Oh, it's a potion. potion. I'm, I'm dumb. Okay. Cool, so... And he's not doing crazy damage. What does that do? What's he cursed with? I don't know. Ancient you know. curse. Okay. Let's just keep swinging it at him. Maybe it lowers damage. No. Oh, you can just switch with some of that Okay, well, just, like, don't bother doing that anyway. Let's just keep swinging, yeah. Sammy. Zero damage. Good. Oh. Gus needs heals. It's a shame he doesn't have any potions. <laughs> oh, this is bad. Maybe. Maybe, maybe Yosef can uh, pull through. Perhaps? Like, Yosef's doing some damage. Yeah, yeah 80. I, but I bet he has like 2,000 health or something dumb. No, Fuck. Gus is down, and yep. we can't bring him back up. This is the final fight of this thing, though. All we have to do is get out of the cave. Yeah. Theoretically, we can just run from every fight. Go, Yosef! Go, Yosef. It's a drag, but it's going. Yeah. Oh, uh, oh nice, Maria. Dude! Oh, fuck yeah! Maria finished that fight like a real pro. Dude! I guarantee that's better than Mithril. <laughs> like, there's no way that's not. Let's... Oh, yeah. <laughs> Let's see how much better. Let's give it to, to Gus. No. No. Well, fuck. Can His attack him? goes up. No, no, no. Oh. No, that's a literal <laughs> place. <laughs> like, oh, oh, for a second I was like... F I don't... Oh. No, because shield's not actual defense. Uh, yeah, it is. No. Remove oh, it. Right. Remove it. You're right. But... The shield just gives a really good I'm, chance to take no damage. I'm going to equip the diamond shield because it's resistant to bolt. It's just as good as the mithril. Just resistant to stuff. Okay. Well, we now have the goddess spell. Yeah. Clearly, nice. we're better guardians than the guardians, so, uh. Well, it's not that we're better guardians, it's just that we know, beat him, we beat so we're better. But we're not guarding anything. Please tell me that's like an auto out. I hope so. Really like, hope so. we kind of need it. Oh, damn it. <laughs> I'd rather add a man toys. <laughs> That'd be great. No, we no. can't handle the icicles. Yeah, we can. That'll be fine. They'll ruin a. Oops. Nice. I I like Yosef. I do too. Shane's gonna leave our party. Yeah. So let's equip him with some Mithril on him. <laughs> <laughs> Send him on his merry way. Let's take away all of his stuff. He doesn't need it. Nah. But I, I am gonna take away all of his stuff, but we're gonna make sure he's definitely out of the party before I sell it. <laughs> So, I think I'm gonna go back to the Mithril Sword. Okay. Just cause I mean, nah, it's I, hitting more often. It is. 
Like, I don't know what the debuff is that he inflicts, so... Yeah, we, we can look it up. Just don't sell... Oh, dude, so. that's what that door was. Okay, let's get out of here. Yeah. That's nice. What's that? Uh, Black Eyed Peas? I should really know, but I don't. Look at that. Ha! Feels like... They don't like Yosef. No. They don't like yeah, Yosef Yeah, that's the Black Eyed Peas. Cause like, that's uh, the whole like, it's getting hot in here, it's getting hot, is it in I, here? I don't know. It's getting really hot in here, let's crack the window cause it's getting hot in here. So, the weather recently, it's oh, like dude, 60 degrees I today. I love it. it Two days so ago, good. it was 30. Mm -hmm. Now it's 60. I love it. It's like, really nice. I, I mean, oh, fucking Morgan. Can we, if he wants to fight, can we fight? I'm not confident in that. Like, what do you mean, like, if Joseph keeps doing what he's been doing, well, maybe we'll be okay. Maybe you should throw some more potions this way. Because, I, I don't think we're going to fight Morgan. I think Morgan's going to bad mouth us, and we're going to be like, hey, fuck off, and he's like, what are you gonna do about it? And we're gonna be like, fuck off! And he's gonna be like, oh, okay. I don't know. Well, like, Yosef's better now. He's better than he once was. Yeah. Not as good as he ever was. Same as it ever was. Same as it ever was. Alright, so bad. Let's. I guess let's eat on the quick. That from here. Yeah, there's no debate that Yosef needs these potions. Oh! Let's put the ancient sword there. That way you can just switch back and forth. With yeah. Them. Unless that's not how it works. Ooh. We have no idea. It's not gonna hurt. Yeah. Um, so, potion on the sword. Do another one. Oh. <laughs> I know. Nope. Equipment. Maria. Fuck. Maria. Potion. Yeah. Push it. Woo! Items. This is exhilarating. Real exciting stuff we got going on here. Push it! Yosef! Let's go. Alright. We're, we're gonna talk to Borgia and he's gonna be like, Damn you. You ruined me. What? The Emperor will not tolerate failure. I can't go back now. Well, if I'm going down, you're going down with me. So we were fighting. Uh, yeah, we are fighting Borgia. Uh, we can cast a super powerful ice spell on him. I'm down with it. Uh, Nodis. Ice, ice from 16! <laughs> Bye, Borgen. I didn't think it was gonna be that good. Really? Because it wasn't. Really? What? What the fuck, Borgen? That's so lame. Yeah, like, you fucking feel bad, dude. So it's we the just worst. We just the worst. Oh, All right. Okay. Borgen was a scrub. Yeah, fuck. Like Joseph just walks up. He's like, "Hey, Borgen." Dude, four hundred kill, nice. Yeah. Like, we've been pulling out some money. How much money do we have right now? Uh, I think over four. Wow. Five. We just <laughs> <laughs> walked All right. around. Oh, he's not dead. So you got me, but I'm not going alone. Take my final gift. It's gonna be a hell of a ride. <laughs> See you down there. Is he just about to whip out his dick? And roll. Oh. Is he a bomb? He's sad. Oh, fuck. Well, uh, what, what's the Indiana Jones music? No, it's coming too fast. Yosef is dead. <gasps> oh! You coming with us? We want you come. That's why I tell my <laughs> girlfriend. <laughs> <laughs> just go, I can't hold up too much longer. Go now. Well, oh, we didn't steal all of his stuff. No, I'm kidding. Oh, that's Aww. so sad. Yosef's gonna die. That's shitty. Morgan's an asshole, right? Yosef's dead. Oh man, I liked him. He was beast mode supreme. I'm not sure we can get to the town safely without him. What? Do we have his vehicle? Yeah, but we can run into monsters. Oh. <laughs> And we only have Gus and Maria. You know. We got Furian. Oh, yeah, Furian and Maria. 
We don't have Gus. Gus well, is dead. Maria doesn't, you know, have any mana, so to speak. <gasps> Gus has one Gus health! Has one health. Uh, and we spent uh, all of our potions. No, no, we didn't. No, we didn't. No, we all didn't. All but one potion. All but one potion. I think Gus might have some, too. He might. Uh, Alright. <laughs> Gus, Gus, Gus. Gus has two potions. Alright. Remove. Damn it. Why? Remove. It's fine. It's fine. Just give him the two. And remove. And I'm gonna heal him back up. Because I'm very scared right now. This is a really, like, slow mechanic, I feel. What? The inventory? Yeah, like, have you, you've watched some of their Final Fantasy 1 stuff. Yeah. I feel like it goes... I feel like it was better there. Well, I mean, like, it might have been. They just didn't really have too much to work with. Yeah, yeah, we have a lot. Six thousand gil out of that, not including the uh... stuff we can sell. Yeah, like that was a really profitable cave. It was. Uh, I love profitable caves. Yeah. You go in, do your stuff, come back out, and leave money. That's how life works. <laughs> <laughs> I prefer them in the real world, though. Yeah. Not like... in games. Like if, if I can go into a game and walk out with money, I went into the correct game. Yeah. Those are the rules. Also, I forgot how much defense Gus has. These minor monsters aren't gonna touch him. Oh yeah. Like, I'm not... How did he die? Was it just like... It was a lot of, uh... Was it just chip damp? Like, they were slowly chipping him away? Yeah. Like, the monsters in the cave were a lot harder. Uh... Oh. Nope. Oh. It was to the right. Yeah. Or to the left. Not I right. Just... Well, I know it's to the left. It just wasn't... I thought, I saw green and I was like, really? It was that quick to get out of here? No. Nah. I felt like it was a lot longer to get there. Nah. It took like 30 seconds. Alright. Right. Yetis, Yetis, Yetis. Yetis can't touch Gus. No. Yetis can't touch any of them. Uh, they might be able to touch Maria if they were ever to swing at her. Yeah. But they won't. Well, I mean, so it's fine. Uh, I was going to say Gus and Maria have the same armor, so they shouldn't be able to touch her, but... Maria might also have this less natural defense. Mm -hmm. Because Gus is kind of the best at everything. Not at everything. Maria casts way stronger spells than Gus. Yeah, but I'm sure if I took the time and, you know, taught Gus fire, I could sit there and just be like, Alright, Gus, <laughs> I know you don't got very much intelligence, but that intelligence stat's going to go way up. And he's going to be like, you speak animal. <laughs> I love how they made him so dumb he understands beavers. Mm-hmm. That's just... It's, it's really nice. It's cute. Like, I like Gus. Oh, man. What? We gotta, we gotta go tell his, like, daughter that like, Joseph's oh, yeah. dead now. He didn't and give I us an know. item to bring it up with, though. Mm -hmm. so. Wow, this, this is, is a daunting fight. Oh, my gosh. Uh. It's refreshing to come back to these guys so we know it can do no harm. <laughs> oh, you're cute. Oh, oh man. Oh, you're splattered in eight pieces on the floor. The, uh... The end's gonna be so expensive, though. We have, like, 7,000 gil. I'm not even almost worried about the cost of the end. What if the end is, like, $7,000? Well, oh well. We can afford it. There's one yeah, third. 169, 92. Wow. Alright, what's up? 45. 45. Uh. What? I don't know. I'm just... We, we should call it a night after this episode. No, no problem. No, because, like, we're both so out of it. We're just saying off numbers. Well, sir, I mean, like, they understand. Do they? Yeah. Do they understand? We'll take... Audience, do you understand? Comment down below. Yeah, if you understand. And... and if you don't understand, don't comment down below. That's how we'll know. If we get no comments, they don't understand. They don't right. love us, right. Sam. All right, let's go back to the end. <laughs> so we got the goddess spell now, yeah? Yeah. How much is this going to cost us? Some Dude, you were like, it was going to be so expensive. Uh, I wasn't sure. I'm Sam, and I think dumb things. <laughs> I do think a lot of dumb things a lot. That's that's what you're known for. Mm -hmm. uh, oh, dude, let's see what spells are here. Um, yeah, that's about the only thing we have to spend our money on. Mm -hmm. uh, I, I hope they're cool. Me too. I hope there's a Suna. Oh, a Suna and Berserk, I bet. No. Life. Life. That's super useful. Uh, What's Banish do? We oh, know Warp. We got yeah. that as a freebie. Like We need to get Warp as a freebie. That's pretty cool. Uh, we can teach Defearn. Okay. Because it's it's one mana, and like, 
honestly, uh, if you ever get stuck in that situation again, but there's no, like, free escape, yeah. it'd be nice to just have fear and no warp. That's actually makes a lot of sense. Life scroll to Maria. Yeah. That's cool. Alright. Cool. We're golden. I think we go back to Altair. I like Alt. It's there. Let's go tell uh, his yeah. daughter that. He's dead. Hey, what's I up? wonder if it... Oh, okay. Joseph, I will take care of Molly in my place. I'm sure he will be pleased even to know that in heaven. Yeah, he was a monk. He would definitely believe in heaven and stuff. Hey, Molly. A real religious type fellow. Your dad's dead. Dad isn't gonna come back, is he? No. We just told you that he was dead, Molly. <laughs> <laughs> hey, your dad's dead. He's dead. not coming dead back. Dead means not coming back ever, ever. <laughs> dead just there, means he not, doesn't love you. Not even the possibility of it. Oh! Marino's life! Let's just go back and cast <laughs> life on him. That's the logical answer. Yeah, if life is a spell in this game, how is death even a problem? Yeah, that's what I was like. How dead do you have to be? Like, because like, Mindu knows life, and remember, oh yeah, everyone's time must come with the king. No, it doesn't have to come. There's a spell that you know and have cast repeatedly to say, hey, you're not actually dead. Screw Mindu. He just hates the kingdom. He's actually a spy. He's just as bad as Borden. You're right. Uh, I believe it. That's a conspiracy theory I can get behind. <laughs> uh... Where are you, like... On it, like... Square! Square Enix, tell us. How dead does someone have to be for, like, a Phoenix Down or life to not work? Yeah, also, Phoenix Down is a thing in this game. Huh? Mm -hmm. Not in this game. Yeah, it is. Yeah, that's right, it is. But it's, like, 20,000 apiece. It's, like, five. I don't know. Um... Well... I guess that that's it for this episode. Yeah, we're gonna we're gonna go. We're gonna chill out at this fight right here. This fight. Chill out with these blood suckers. We're just gonna Thank make you. out a little bit. Look at those look at those teeth. Mm. Mm. Oh Very yeah. Nice. Uh, so, okay, yeah, you can just totally cool. throw those around. Cool. That's awesome. Um, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Yeah. Uh, Thanks for we, watching this episode. We love you all. We love you, uh, each and every one of you. We all of you. Individually, as people, we support you in your life endeavors. Yeah, like um, just everything like, about you. We care about you. You are valid. You're my best friend, random watcher that I don't know. <laughs> you, Pussy Slayer 42. <laughs> You're the best. I really appreciate you and everything you do. <laughs> one one day, if if we ever get popular, someone's gonna like message on like someone's gonna make a fucking what is it account called Pussy Slayer Forty Two and be like, yeah, I love you too. <laughs> <laughs> All right, bye guys. <laughs>